Now, you know, but that's the government's job. It's not my job. It's not the job of individuals. You are the government in democracy, dumbass. I think it's better if they repent. I think they ought to repent. I think they ought to turn from their selfish lifestyle. You know, the Surgeon General has determined that sodomy is hazardous to your anus. <laughs> Uh, Where do y'all get these little yeah, sound bites from? Bullshit is hazardous to you know, if you love your neighbor, you're not going to go sodomize him. Or you're not going to stick your penis where it doesn't belong. And you're not going to fill his head with bullshit lies based on myths and superstition like you. But wait a minute. Well, young wait man, a a, uh, let me tell you something. Tell uh, you, take a, uh, you take a black man and a white woman, and you get them married. Uh, they can reproduce. Or uh, you take a white man and a black woman, you, uh, you get them married, they'll reproduce. Or uh, you take a black man and a white man, you put them together, they can't reproduce. You take a white woman and a black woman, you put them together, they can't reproduce. You got something uh, you pretty hot, a, though. You take a man and a dog, and they can't reproduce. Uh, you take a, you take a, uh, you take a dog and a cat, they can't reproduce. That's uh, unnatural. According to your argument, that means that if a man uh, has sex with a woman who has had menopause, therefore has become infertile. No, you see, uh, uh, marriage, uh, sex between a man and a woman that love each other, that are married, uh, was given by as a gift from God. Uh, you know, I I have great holy sex to my wife all the time, and I enjoy it very much. Like Please tell us says, more. The Bible says marriage is honorable and all in the bed undefiled, but whoremongers and adulterers God will.